Hey, I'm Dr. Brian Kinzel with the Bob Flagstaff, showing here what I call the two-way calf raise. So uh, we're trying to strengthen both muscles of the calf complex, the soleus and the gastroc. So the soleus does not cross the knee, it stops in the lower leg, and it's best strengthened when the knee is in a position of flexion. The gastroc crosses the knee and is best strengthened when the knee is straight. So usually we gotta do two different exercises. And so this one goes out to uh, Chris Johnson, a physical therapist, I think up in Seattle. He came up with this one, so I'm just showing it here. We're gonna get a box or a bench, we want the knee at about 90 degrees, and I'm gonna set a weight on my top knee, and I'm gonna come into a little dorsiflexion. So I'm actually pulling here with the front of my shin. So I'm not here, but I'm kind of pulling forward. And then I'm gonna come up into a calf raise here, come back down, then come up on my back leg. And then I'm just gonna alternate so on my front leg, I'm working soleus. On my back leg, I'm working gastroc. A couple cues. I like to try to push down through the middle and inside of my foot, almost with my big toe, pushing my big toe flat, not curling it, but pushing it flat. That can get some of the arch of the foot and the posterior tibialis too. And then I wanna come up. And on my back leg, I wanna try and go straight up on this back leg. I don't wanna just dive forward because then I kind of offload that back leg. So I'm gonna come up on the back leg, come up on the front leg. It takes a little coordination, but then you get the hang of it. I'm gonna to go to fatigue. Usually it takes about 15, 20 reps, and then I'll switch sides. And now I'm gonna fatigue a little quicker because I already pre-fatigued the calf on both sides, but I'm gonna to go to fatigue again. As you get this down, if you wanna play with some variations, you can actually hover here for a little isometric. So I'm gonna come up, come down, but not fully down, I'm up just a hair and hold that. Now I'm working to stabilize as I come up on my back leg. And I can hold that down there as well. So then that's, boom, a whole ton of work because neither leg is really resting. So we call that the two-way calf raise. Um, you can go pretty heavy. This is 35 pounds. I have some athletes go up to 50 or even 70. If you don't have any weight, just start with body weight and see how it goes. And then you can stack textbooks, whatever you have. Uh, but, but see, I usually do three to four sets. You might be a little sore in your calves after you try that the first time.